What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here to bring you some more Super Smash Brothers news coverage, but I ain't a news channel though. Um, moving onward, I heard some things about music being customizable in Smash 3DS due to some apparent hack that's been going on. Now, I don't have all the references from that because there were a lot of sources that were telling me about this on Twitter, and I really only caught this one. Now, there might be some more. Maybe we'll do a little bit of research after the video if we're left with some more questions, but Apparently, there's a way you can hack your own music in Smash. I have no idea how this is done, but we do have this tweet right here from Dylan, who said, some rather interesting music apparently found in the 3DS version of Smash Brothers. Now, when I first read this, of course I obviously thought about the whole Ryu and Roy themes being found in the game's um, DLC download files, but I mean, I don't know for a fact what this is. Like I say, first time reaction to everything, so let's see exactly what's going on here. So this involves Smash 3DS music, so this is going to be on the 3DS version, obviously. Um, this video was posted yesterday as well, too. With 3,000 views, there may just be something interesting here. So let's see what's going on. Custom music in Smash for 3DS. What the hell? Yeah, that music is different. There's some way that this guy is able to hack music into this game. Is there some more examples of this? What the hell? Okay, now the first thing that comes to mind is that maybe he's maybe he's falsifying this by putting like a music track on in the background while he has the music off for the game, but then that just deconfirmed it because now he's actually at the um, at the exploration screen of the classic mode. Is it classic mode? Yeah, I think it's um, solo mode. And even though he's here, even though the music should be off of the game, for him to be able to play the music behind the stages before, for some reason, the song's playing over here. So, I mean, he doesn't have music off of the game, which means that there is different background music that's in the game that's playing right now. Have I ever expressed to you guys this, this weird thing I have with the whole, um, Adventure mode thing where it's, it's this is, well, I don't know, what is this called? I think it's just called classic mode? I'm sorry, it doesn't come to mind, but I mean, the whole thing where you like begin a fight and it goes like, ah, 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 like that shit is so fucking epic. But okay, let's see, let's see what's going on. Did we just get a camera cut? Alright. So this music is regular. Keep moving forward. Yeah, he has different music in there, definitely. So this isn't like a hack or like a like a glitch or an error. Like this is intentional. I'm sure there are ways, though. I mean, people have dumped the 3DS ROM at this point and figured out every single little nook and cranny inside of it. So I mean. It shouldn't be too difficult to install your own sound files in there if they're in the right format. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, different music here too. Pretty epic though. So, I guess the general conclusion is that there is a way to get your own music in there. And some of you may see this as being pointless, because I know a lot of, I mean, I shouldn't say a lot of people, but I know some people don't really have, have a, have a bond to the soundtrack in a lot of games, you know? Like, it's just kind of like background sound to them, and that's all it is. But music for me in games kind of makes up a lot of the experiences I've expressed many times before, which is why I have a video of me orgasming in my pants, listening to a fucking soundtrack from a game. But I mean, either way, I want to talk more about how the hell this is possible. So obviously the YouTube comments are the first place to go. How do you do this? Comment, blah, 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 blah. All right, nothing so far. Uh, someone linked me, Etika, get your ass over here. So I, I, I didn't even get here through this person uh, mentioning me. It was through this Twitter post, but um, let's see, cool. You should make a video on how you do this. Wait, if actually did hack the music in the game, then this is the beginning of Smash 4 hacks. Hopefully it will be possible to hack the Wii U version though. And he says, but it's going to be the beginning of homebrew and the beginning of more patches to the Wii U. Actually, that could be the very thing that people exploit to run homebrew software. Um, so I guess people are going in. Um, there's no real way that people are showing how to do this thing. So I mean, 
Oh, well, I guess we'll just leave it alone for now. But damn, it, there really must be a way to do this. I just... Let's see. Well, this is actually a really popular channel that uploads a lot of um, game soundtrack songs. With 100,000 subscribers on top of it all, so... Pretty impressive. But we're not seeing any way that they made that possible, so... Either way, guys, at least this is a video to inform you that there is now a way to put your own custom background music, at least in the Smash 3DS version, which might even mean less to you guys, because I know a lot of you don't play the 3DS version anymore. Unlike myself, I play it religiously, and the only reason why I do that is because the control scheme is just a lot better for me. I tried the GameCube version, I mean, I tried the GameCube controller, it doesn't work for me, and, you know, the, the tablet controller just, nah. And the Pro Controller, it just feels way too bleh. So I mean, yeah, that's the only reason why I play the 3DS version, so this video means more to me than it would for the majority of you guys, but what do you think about this whole thing? I think it's great, although I usually do turn the music off in my Smash game if I want to put my own custom music in the background and videos and whatnot, but you guys, let me know what you think about this whole thing. If it's practical, will you use it? Let me know. I'll talk to you in the next one. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.